Okay, so um, a couple of days ago, I was driving to an office from my apartment or house, but uh, I was driving in a highway and uh, in a in a in a like I'm I'm in a city. I was driving in a highway in a city, but tell me why. Um, tell me why I saw I I saw this woman in the corner of my eyes on the right side. She was uh she was literally on the fucking highway like uh she was literally on a fucking highway trying to cross the highway like who the fuck does that though it makes no damn sense of why you want to cross the highway you think that they think that she thought uh, she thought that the cars were gonna stop for her or or something like that but i don't i don't um i know i haven't I didn't, I didn't see the ending because i i i didn't see it because i was gone um but uh the other thing I found it weird and stupid of what she did was there was literally a bridge right on top of her. The the bridge had um had a sidewalk which she could have just walked through without worrying about getting hit by fucking cars that's going sixty miles an hour. But I guess she didn't want to see she wanted to be stupid and cross the fucking highway, which it makes no sense at all though. Like why do people do that? Just like a couple uh a year ago or something, uh it was like at nine o'clock p.m. or ten o'clock p.m. I was driving home from work. Um, I noticed this guy. He literally came out of nowhere. He was like I was in the highway, and he was on my right again. He he was literally walking in the highway, walking like walking by the, um by the uh, by the emergency stop, uh, you know those, you know when you're driving in a highway, you see, um, like, it depends on what kind of highway you're in, or like, um, highways are highways, but, uh, they, every, every, um, every highway have an emergency stop where, well, if your, like, car is broken down, you stop right by it, but he was literally walking right by, like, right in that, in that area, right next to the cars. He could have got like ran over or some shit like that, and he was night guy. He didn't have any uh, flashlight or anything with him. Nobody would have been able to see that. But um, it's kind of dangerous um, of why people are doing this. I don't know why, and I don't even want to know why. But uh, that's why I usually be looking out for <coughs> stupid stuff like this every single day. I watch a lot of. Uh, um, road collisions on YouTube videos on, on YouTube and things like that. And I noticed that there's a lot of stupid drivers here. A whole lot of stupid drivers. And it's going to take me a long time to name how many stupid shit they do every single day. And it pissed me off. Somebody could be having a great day and a stupid ass driver could have ruined that moment for them. Like, um, a couple months ago, I was driving one of my coworker home, but then that was back when I used to work at McDonald's. I noticed that like, uh, like a fucking high speed chase that was going on. That it was uh, there was a big ass red pickup truck that was going really fast on a fucking pedestrian road, and uh, there were like three police cars following him. And uh, I saw up uh, uh, as I was turning the corner. I saw it. Um, I saw him hitting another car right on the in intersection near me. Once he hit that car, I heard that. I, I didn't see the ending of that one either. But there was a lot of uh, police cars and firefighters and ambulance over there at the scene at that time. But as again, this was a couple months ago now. But hopefully the guy's fine and hopefully the driver he hit is fine. Uh, but uh, and but I hope he got arrested for reckless driving, causing uh, almost like I mean I would say at this time it would probably be <coughs> reckless driving and also um um almost killing somebody. He the, this guy literally almost killed somebody. Once he hit the car, he got he got ejected off his truck, uh, uh, off in the fucking pavement in front of uh in front of the truck it took the police like a couple minutes to find him that's what i heard but but then they found they they found him and they took him into custody there's a whole lot of stuff that be going on 
in uh, this world. But uh, just for those of you guys who are still living, breathing, I want you guys to have fun. Just uh, go out there, have fun, but just be safe and look out for stupid, reckless drivers. And uh, don't. And also um, look out for crazy maniacs that could be trying to ruin your day. But as again, that's going to be a whole lot of problem in the future. Just uh, look out for those and uh, try not to be in a wrong place at the wrong time. But it's kind of hard to do that for some of people. For some people, but H O R, I don't know. I don't know how to tell you. I mean, it's it's really dangerous world out here, man. Some of us are trying to live. Whether some of us are trying to kill the, the ones who are trying to live, and uh, yeah, it's it's crazy. Just like um, a couple, like nearly. A couple, um, I would say this was uh, last summer now, but when I was driving uh, my old car, this is uh, a car that I bought a couple months ago, but last year I used to drive a 2007 Jeep Liberty, but um, when I was driving that car, tell me why a fucking pickup truck was like right next to me, and I thought he saw me. He literally, he was literally right next to me. But the thing is, he, I, I saw him putting on his blinker, like right next to me over here. I, I saw, he, I, I saw that his blinker was on. He was trying to turn left, but no, he was trying to. I thought he was like trying to turn in the left lane, but that dude literally came and swore right into me to go to a fucking parking lot. Who the fuck does that? What kind of fucking, uh, what kind of fucking driving is that? I feel like all these people should get their license revoked and go back to driver's ed and restart driving again. Because that's so stupid of why you would just uh, decide to turn in the fucking parking lot when you're not when you're not in the right area to turn. That makes no sense. Because sometimes I wish the police were there to be there in the right time to catch these idiotic drivers. I mean, um, I'm not going to lie. You, I, I kind of speed a little bit, but... I don't be driving that idiotic like that, bro. I mean, yeah, it's uh, it's insane, but it's crazy out here, man. Just um, again, just be safe out there and just enjoy life. And thank you.